In this video, we will specifically be following Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis, who are the Prince of Princess of Wales' three young children, and we'll be seeing how their outfits compare to their parents' outfits, and how their hand-me-downs are an important continuancy of royal tradition. In this video, we're going to explore the background as to why the royal family use hand-me-downs, and what the hand-me-downs actually signify in the British royal family, because their hand-me-downs actually signify something different to you or I using hand-me-downs. You know what a hand-me-down is? It's basically a piece of clothing that is given from either a sibling to a younger sibling, or from um, someone to another person. In this case, um, a hand-me-down can also be from uh, a father to maybe a son, or a mother to a daughter. Also, in some families, it can be grandparents to grandchildren or great-grandparents to great-grandchildren. Wearing hand-me-downs is a part of childhood for almost all children out there, especially now that clothing is pretty expensive, and not even the Prince and Princess of Wales's children have managed to escape it. Through the years so far, we've seen Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis wearing clothes their royal relatives supported first. And if you've been watching the royals for a very, very long time and you've seen Prince William grow up and, you know, you've seen King Charles grow up, you may find it very nostalgic that George, Charlotte and Louis are re-wearing some of their family's traditional clothing. Right, so let's dive straight into this video and have a look at some of George, Charlotte and Louis' clothing that they would have borrowed from their royal relatives over the years. Some of these clothing, they may have even taken inspiration from their royal relatives as well, so let's get straight onto it. First up, we have Prince William. When Prince William attended the Troop in the Colour in 1985, he would have been about three years old then. He wore an adorable sailor suit, an outfit that was pretty on trend for kids at the time. And more than 30 years later, at the Troop in the Colour in 2022, which was part of the late Queen's Platinum Jubilee, Prince Louis was spotted on the Buckingham Palace balcony wearing the very same sailor suit that his dad once did. Moving on to Prince William's christening gown now, and his christening gown was actually something really historical. Even for him, it was a hand-me-down with royals going f as far back as George V, who also donned the lace dress on their special days, and it was really special to see Prince William continuing that tradition. Before Prince George was born in 2013, a replica was made of the original christening gown so that royal children could continue to wear it through the years. So when Prince George was born on the 22nd of July, that's exactly what he wore, a replica. So while Prince George didn't wear the exact gown his dad did, he actually wore a replica of it, which basically meant that it was very, very, very similar. His siblings, Princess Charlotte, who was born on the 2nd of May 2015, and Prince Louis, who was born on the 23rd of April 2018, would also have worn the replica gown when it was their turn to be christened. Moving on now to Prince William's first troop in the colour. Prince William made his Troop in the Colour debut in 1984, and of course he did so much in style. At his Troop in the Colour debut back in 1984, he wore a blue and white two-piece outfit that just so happened to match his mum's ensemble. Decades later, when Prince George made his first appearance at Troop in the Colour, of course he wore the same outfit that his dad Prince William did. It must have been pretty nostalgic for the late Queen when she saw Prince George in this outfit, because it probably reminded her of when Prince William first wore this outfit on his Troop in the Colour debut back in 1984. Moving now on to the day that Princess Charlotte was born on the 2nd of May 2015. On that day, Prince George and Prince William were seen waving outside the Lindo Wing before heading into the hospital to visit the Princess of Wales and meet Princess Charlotte for the first time. And I think it's just really cute. The day that Prince George became a big brother, Prince George wore a blue sweater with matching navy shorts and knee-high socks. And you won't guess who used the cardigan next. If you guessed Princess Charlotte, congratulations, you got it right. Knowing how often the Princess of Wales repeats her own favourite uh, wardrobe pieces, it's no surprise that her children do exactly the same. The following year, in 2016, Princess Charlotte was actually spotted at a children's event wearing the exact same cardigan, definitely following in her big brother's footsteps. Moving on now to the first portrait of Prince George and Princess Charlotte together. This was taken after the then Cambridge family became a family of four for the very first time. The siblings took a sweet photo together and you'll probably notice that Princess Charlotte is wearing a white knit little baby grow. Well, around three years later when Prince Louis came along, he wore that exact same baby grow that Princess Charlotte wore around three years before Prince Louis did. Of course, now we're moving on to a very little and cheeky Prince Harry who also got involved in the Troop in the Colour fashion fun here. In this photo you can see he's wearing a blue and white embroidered outfit, and this photo was taken in 1986. 
Around 33 years later, this look is stolen by Prince Louis. Back in 2019, Prince Louis made his debut at Troop in the Colour, wearing an outfit that was passed down to him from his uncle Harry. You probably noticed the pattern already, but it was really sweet to see Prince George rewear Prince William's Troop in the Colour outfit, while Prince Louis rewore Prince Harry's. Brothers, eh? Now moving on to Prince George's red shorts. When they're young, royal boys are generally expected to wear shorts, and Prince George's short collection when he was younger was really rather expensive. Here he is wearing his lovely striped red shorts. When attending the Chelsea Flower Show in 2019, Prince Louis donned Prince George's exact red shorts that he'd worn when he was younger. And Prince Louis looked just as adorable in them as big brother Prince George did when he wore them. Coming up next, we've got Prince George's shirt jumper. So, while at the same party where Prince Charlotte was wearing this cute cardigan that was a hand-me-down from Prince George, Prince George himself was also wearing another piece that he had no idea would become a hand-me-down in the future. His navy blue shirt jumper. When Prince Louis joined his family in meeting Sir David Attenborough, Prince Louis actually got the chance to rewear Prince George's shirt sweater. And as you can see, Prince Louis looked just as smart as Prince George did in it. So there you have it, that is just a few of the royal hand-me-downs that we have found out for you all. Make sure to comment down below which one was your favourite. And yes, that's the end of the video, we hope you have a wonderful rest of your day wherever you are. And we hope to see you in the next video. Thanks for watching everyone, bye!